What's up DPFL, Grant Evans here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to set up your camera with Discord if you're using a laptop or desktop computer and an external webcam. Now, the first thing you need to do, if you don't have a webcam, you can go to the DPFL store and tech and online darts and you'll see a bunch of different webcams, mounting software, everything you need to get your setup good to go. After you get that webcam, first thing you're going to do is plug it into any open USB port on your computer. Uh, if your cord is not long enough to wherever you want your laptop or desktop to be, you can get a USB extension cable, but make sure it's one that says it's active, an active USB extension. Uh, that will boost the signal along the cable. Um, just keep in mind that the longer the extension cable, the higher the chance is that you'll run into problems getting the best quality picture from your camera to your computer. Um, so after you plug in that camera the first time it might start an installation program for software that the manufacturer wants you to have like my Logitech C920 has the G-Hub Logitech program. This is where you can update the software, the firmware with the camera but most cameras are just gonna work straight out of the box, plug it in, good to go. So after you plug that in, you're going to open Discord, you're going to go to the DPFL server. Then you're going to go in this bottom left corner, user settings. About halfway down is the voice and video settings. The first thing you're going to check here is your voice. Um, the input device is going to be the microphone you're talking into so that your opponent hears you. The output device is going to be your speakers on your laptop or computer, your headset, your AirPods, whatever you want to use to hear your opponent talk. You can test your microphone here by doing the let's check and you should see you some should, um, yellow bars yellow going. Bar that, going. Means, that means Discord is Discord hearing, is your, hearing voice your voice through, through the option. The option. Um, default is probably going to be the go-to setting for m most of you um, to solve any problems. Mine is my is showing this. This is the external I wear a Bluetooth headset when I play just so it it's easier for me to stand away from my computer um, and hear my opponent talk to my opponent um, but whatever you want to do just make sure you, these are set to the, what you want them to be now scroll down to your camera here and in the drop down box you're gonna select that camera that you just plugged in if you have a laptop it might have the face cam that's like above the screen listed and then the one you just plugged in mine I have OBS virtual camera I'm using that because I'm using that software to record this video right now um, but you're gonna select the name of the camera that you plugged in the external one now hit test video and you should see that video pop up if that does then you should be good to go um, to start a match um, so now let's show how we're gonna start a match so in the season 8 uh, I'm viewing this as a Division II Group A player, so you're going to see your group chat with the two boards below it underneath your division category. To join the voice chat or the board, just click the name of it. You're going to hear that little ding that says you joined uh, and see your name underneath it. Um, that means you are in the voice chat. So you're going to want to click that name again to display your partner's board or your opponent's board. Um, before you turn your camera on, it's just going to be your profile picture with some color around it. To turn on your camera from here, you hit the far left option on these bottom five options, turn on camera. Since we just did that in the settings, it should be good to go. If it's not, this little small circle should have those options. Select the right one that is your external camera that's pointing at your board and you'll be good to go. Um, to make your board bigger or your opponent's board bigger, you can just click on it. Um, don't worry about it being reversed or mirrored. That's only on your end. Um, it's a Discord setting that can't be changed. Uh, I'm not sure why they do it. I think it's with the left, right when you're looking at yourself, but it's just a setting that can't be changed. Your opponent will see it normal. Um, you just see it mirrored. So after you click on your opponent's board to make them bigger, you can play like this. Uh, I like to pop this into a new window, meaning it's a, like a separate window that can be moved around on itself. 
You do that by going down here in the corner, the pop out button. It's going to open it in its own window so that you can like move it around. Maybe you want to snap it to the side, anything. Um, but it's separate from the Discord app. You can still scroll through the channels, go through, look at other channels, but you'll still be in this voice chat um, in that separate window. If you want to make it slightly bigger, you can use this full screen at the bottom. It's just going to eliminate the top and bottom bars. Um, but if you're playing on a small screen, that might help you just a little bit more. Um, so you play your match. You exit the full screen. Um, done playing your match. To leave the voice chat, you just go to the far right of the bottom five options, the red circle with the phone and the X, and click it. You're going to hear the another sound that's going to notify you that you left the voice chat that sound there um, that is all you need to know um, for those of you that use a browser it's going to be almost the same um, there might be uh, something that pops up when you go to test your video that says like allow access My, um, this is Chrome so it says like Discord wants to use your camera just click that allow access um, other browsers Edge or Mozilla or Safari might have different pop-ups, but it'll basically be asking the same thing to access your camera. Um, but you should be good to go as far as setting up your camera. And as always, good luck. Chew well.